In this video I'm gonna show you how you can charge Google Pixel 9a. There are a couple of methods that allow you to charge the phone. So the first method is to use a wireless charger. Ideally your wireless charger should have at least 7.5 watts of power simply because this is the maximum amount of power that the battery on this phone receives. So if you happen to have more than that, it's still fine. If you happen to have less, for example, 5 watts, it's it's going to still work, um, but it will be slower just a little bit. So use at least 7.5 watts if possible. And of course, in order to charge the phone, we need to simply place it on top of the charge. And as you can see, we are charging pretty much immediately. You don't have to turn on or off anything. It just works instantly. Now, the faster method to charge our phone is by using the USB cable. But in that case, we also need to have a charger or a power adapter. Now, I have my Xiaomi charger over here. It works as well, so you don't have to purchase the original Google charger or anything like that. If you have any other well-known brand, it works as well. You just need to take care of the port. You need to pay attention to that. And that is all you need. And of course, this is the fastest way to charge our phone. With the USB cable, you just plug it into the charger, I mean the phone to the charger, and then you charge your phone. So let's just plug it in to the USB-C port that we have at the bottom. And there we go, we are charging. Now in this case, ideally we need to have at least 23 watts in our charger or power adapter. Of course, once again, we can have more than that. Um, it won't like have any negative effect. And that is pretty much everything. Now, if you don't have a charger or a power adapter right now, but you have the uh, USB cable, we have the original cable in the box, then you can also use anything else that provides a power through the USB-C port. Uh, so for example, a computer, if you have USB-C port on your computer, then you can use that at least temporarily until you get the charger or power adapter. Keep in mind that charging through a computer is just slow. Um, so it's just like, um, like I said, like a temporary thing. Um, if you have no other option for a moment, then of course you can use that. And that's about it. Thanks for watching. Leave a like and subscribe to my channel and see you in my next videos. Bye.